we're gonna use two techniques. I'm gonna show two techniques. Uh, one is using uh, chamfer and jet play, and one is using just pure rounder with default settings, just to smack it up fast. Um, let's go with the rounder first, and uh, I'll add thickness to this. You'll see though that uh, it flipped this one. I shouldn't have done that. And now we'll just simply use rounder with these settings and we're good to go. Sort of. Uh, this here is not that nice, so maybe you want to fix that. This though is good, so what we'll do is um, let's see, take these, uh, expand that selection, convert that to polygon selection, but I don't want these guys. Uh, I don't want it to smooth those, so I'll just deselect them. So all the guys pointing outwards, I'm gonna leave them, while the one pointing inwards, I'm gonna smooth them. So if I smooth this now, like 200 or so, yeah, looks good. So. Um, yeah, that's the rounder method. Fast and could be faster, of course. Um, but you can see that it leaves this kind of corner, so we don't want that. And that's why we're going to have a look at uh, using JFLA and, um, and chamfer. So we'll take this guy and we'll use JFLA. I'm going to use six segments this time around and delete those. In order to make this work I'm gonna have to go like that. Uh, so I'll bevel, bevel it inwards first and then use the thicken tool. Um, the reason for that is because the bevel kind of like uh, flipped around. I'm not gonna get into that but uh, so already you can see that it looks good. Um, you can see that this round is here is much smoother and nicer than we have in rounder. Uh, but this of course needs more work. So take these guys and loop. And here's the chamfer trick of course. Use chamfer and go like that and find about the, the roundness that you want. Is that good? Maybe you want a bit more like that. And here's uh, where it differs from the other video I made. Here we're going to deselect and then select those over again. And loop and use chamfer one more time. Uh, you could leave it at that. So this creates kind of like a, um, a robotic give edge, um, some industry edge. So that's cool. But in this case, uh, I want a round edge, so I'm going to keep it like this, right? Take these four guys and those four guys over again, loop, and once again, chamfer, sort of like this. So, and there we go. Um, now it's looking nice. Right? So that's two ways going about this kind of uh, rounding. So this method and that method.